All right, hello and welcome again to another episode of Elite Fitness and Nutrition Exercise of the Week. I'm Coach Ryan. So today we're gonna to get a little more specific with our technique. We're gonna talk about the positioning of our bar on our back. And this is true with any exercise you do with the bar loaded on your back, okay? So there's three things I wanna consider. And I'm gonna start with this PVC to give you a better idea of what this looks like. So I've got this bar on my shoulders, okay? First off, I wanna get this bar as low on my traps as I can comfortably get it right there, number one. Number two, I'm gonna flatten out my wrists. I don't want my wrists in this flex position. That's gonna loosen up my thoracic spine and take my tension away. So I'm gonna flatten out my wrists and I'm gonna pull my elbows under. So you can see how this bar is bending. I'm creating some good tension, okay, right here, where when I have a flat bar, a metal bar, that bar isn't gonna bend, but instead it's gonna pull my shoulders and pull my thoracic spine back into that proper position right there. Okay, so it looks like this on the bar. Grip under, I got it low, I got my wrist flat, I got my elbows under, and I'm off the bar and right here in this tight position. That is the position that I wanna have anytime I've loaded a bar on my back. So try that as you're going through your different exercises, your back squats, your split squats, and see if that doesn't help improve your movement pattern, help you bust through some of your plateaus, and just a better feel for the exercise. All right, guys, we hope that helped. Good luck, and as always, live a lean.